Hi guys, what's up? This is PJ, and uh, today in this video, I will be showing you some features that Windows 10 is having, and you haven't heard about these features. So let's move on to the features. The number one feature is to pin the specific sections to the start menu from the settings. You can pin anything. Like if you want to pin, if you if you want to pin Bluetooth, you can directly pin it to the start. So uh, this is a nice feature. It reduces the steps which we require from our setting menu. So you can directly jump to the Bluetooth from the start menu. So this is the nice feature which Windows 10 is having. Another another feature is another new feature is the storage analyzer. So just go to the settings, go to the system, and you will see storage here. So this is the new storage analyzer. You can check your drive space, how much space the application are taking from your drive. Like you can clear this temporary data you can play your previous version of windows which is taking around 26 gb so it is very important uh, application which windows is having this is the storage analyzer another new feature which uh, which windows 10 is having is you can uninstall any app from the start you can you have to just click on any application you have installed just uninstall it right from here so this is very useful In Windows 10, you can customize your command prompt also. So this is the new feature which Windows 10 is having. You can customize your command prompt. So go to the command prompt and go to the properties. You can change the color, you can change its font and all that. So this is the new feature. This is a lovely new feature of the Windows 10. Another new feature is you can customize your notification area so you can go to the settings and you can customize your notification icons and all that you can have VPN you can have Bluetooth directly the notification icon it has one new feature which is the virtual desktop you might be knowing uh, about this feature but I will be telling you some shortcuts to change the desktop so it is windows plus control plus right and left key so you can skip through the desktops and if you want to close you can just click on control windows plus f4 so that's it guys uh, thanks for watching this video and please give a thumbs up if you like this video and don't forget to subscribe